Hey, it's Nicholas Matt today. Hello, I'm back. Hello, I'm back. I'm back to see you. Uh, thank you very much. Just a sneaky quickie today. Quick sneaky quickie about stuff that's gone on in the past few days. We might like it. You might not. And we'll see how we get on. Okay. I'm super fine now. I'm not dying or anything. Yeah. Diet's boring, no. Oh, no tea, no coffee, no fizzy drinks, no blah, 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 blah. But you don't want to hear that, do you? No, you don't. So, we'll go to our browser. Oh, by the way, we're in LXD today, which is 11.10. Okay, Ubuntu 11.10, or should we say Lubuntu 11.10? And we're in LXD, because I like LXD. Although it's got some quirkiness at the moment. I hope they can sort it out. It's a real pity that 12.04 is not going to be LTS. But we have to live with this, don't we? So, never mind. Onwards and forwards to what we're going to talk about for this sneaky quickie. Right, <clears throat> what was you doing the other day? When the Raspberry Pi launched, well, I got sneaky wife to get me up really early, like half past five in the bleeding morning. Considering I didn't go to bed till half past three, I got up, I come down, logged in, and guess what had happened? The guys they've used to actually do the stuff, Premier Farnell and RS Components, bearing in mind I've used RS Spares, what used to be RS Spares years ago, it's now RS Components. I've used them like since 1981 okay they've been around a long 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 time and both their sites just crashed completely and people had real 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 problems okay so i don't even know if my order went through because it just nothing was happening properly really but hey i can wait a bit longer no big deal yeah it might come in the post might not who knows be nice though because all i really wanted to do was just take it to my local schools and get them to check it out for the kids really there's nothing else nothing else at all uh, another bit of news for the raspberry pi the a model has now had its ram doubled they're not going to go with the low ram version which i think was 128 i can't actually remember don't quote me on it because i can't remember it's quite late tonight but yeah that was really nice i'm not sure the price is going to increase but hey it doesn't really matter 25 dollars or 18 quid who who gives a doodah really nobody really do. it's like what you'd spend on a 20 minutes of your Saturday night out doesn't cost any money whatsoever and can do a lots and lots and lots of stuff. Bearing in mind, there are other things available that do the same sort of stuff, but not as cheap. You know what I'm saying? $25. Well cheap, isn't it? Yeah, well, 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 well cheap. And if all you young people can learn to code on it, it'd be really good. Next <clears throat> is the Young Rewired State. Is this August in the UK and around the world, okay? Doesn't matter what country in, there will be something going on around you, apparently, okay? I know this ain't going uh, on the east coast of the US in New York State, I think, I can't remember, but you have to log in and check it out. So if you're under 18 or 18, check it out if you want to go and check something out for a week. You know, do a bit of coding, get learning from people that know what they're doing, and you'll learn lots and lots. And if you want to be a mentor, so you're a coder and you're doing a bit of coding, you don't have to be a super duper coder. No, you don't have to be not super duper. You can you, anything you can do will help these kids so that's really really good and in the uk at the last day we're going to be at bletchley park apparently yes the home of computing you know what i'm saying long story google it if you don't know but yeah please try and get involved it'd be really really good all right so there should be something going on in the country around near you if there's not go and find out and get, do it in your own country check it out okay finally <clears throat> Into coding we go. Mike OS, right, Mike, this is Mike Saunders. He does some stuff for Linux Format Magazine. They said this operating system going for about six years, and I've played with it several times. And I got a new one every day, and it was really, really nice to play with. Really, really nice. Simple, basic, lovely, super duper. So if you want to play with coding, go and give it a download. And you'll say, oh, no, it's going to be such a big download. No, it'll be about half a second. And I'll show you why. The actual OS it's only 383k so we're going back to spectrum days here if none of you know what spectrum is you're too young if you do you're too old like me and there's lots of stuff you can get for it and this it comes with quite a few bits and bobs if you want to play a bit of coding go and give it a download and i'm sure we'll like it too but don't ask him too much like you know what i mean you know he's got stuff to do people to see place to go and i'm saying oh yeah we'll get rid of that Okay, that's finally from me. That's a nice little sneaky quickie, and I like it very much. So I hope you'll keep them well. 
don't forget you can follow me on Twitter and all that and stuff and Google Plus I'm on Google Plus as well I don't do Facebook so don't even bother searching for me there so if you really want to get a hold of me or anything like that it's Twitter or Google Plus uh, and that's about it really yeah sneaky Linux at and tomorrow we've got a really really nice one for you oh yes really nice I'm gone bye bye